Hi guys, I am Professor Girish Kukreja back with our today's question. Today we will be dealing with bioenergetics, uh, some energy considerations in a typical redox reaction, an oxidation reduction reaction. We here have a reaction catalyzed by glutathione reductase which is uh, oxidized, which is reducing this glutathione using NADPH and H plus as the electron and reducing equivalent donor. We have the values of E0 prime for both the pairs that is for glutathione as well as for this NADP plus and NADPH. The values here respectively are minus 0.23 and uh, minus 0.32 volts, right? We have to calculate the value of delta G0 prime for this reaction. We know that for a typical redox reaction, the formula goes as delta G0 prime is equal to minus NF delta E0 prime, right? N number of reducing equivalents. Right, so that is here 2, so minus 2 into F Faraday's constant, they are given here as 96.5, so this I take as 96.5 into delta E0, so E0 is that of uh, difference between that of E0 values of the acceptor minus that of the donor. So here the acceptor is the glutathione which we have minus 0.23 minus that of the donor, so here donor we have NADP plus. NADPH, so that value is minus 0.32. Solving out this, this we will get positive multiplied by this minus will be negative. So the value which we have is 17.37 kilojoule per mole, right? So the value of delta G0 prime for this reaction would be minus 17.37 kilojoule per mole. Remember that instead of NADP plus, here if there is an isoenzyme which is using NADP and NADH as the pair for uh, what you call as donating the reducing equivalents uh, even then this value will not change much it will neither be lower or higher it will remain as it is so with this uh, you can calculate the value of this delta G0 prime remember the formula delta G0 prime is equal to minus N F delta E0 prime stay tuned with us for more such questions thank you